Hello everyone and welcome to this Fallout 4 next gen update video. In this one we are going over the Echoes of the Past, a new quest added with the update and one that adds in Enclave Remnants to the world. This includes more weapons and armors and while doing the quest you will come across the Enclave Hellfire Power Armor, the Enclave Exo 2 Armor which is different from the regular Exo 2 Armor and the Enclave Colonel Uniform along with various weapons you can loot as well so let's jump into it. You start the quest at Fort Hagen and close by is an enclave ambush and you must defeat these enemies and read the soldiers orders. This will mark a new location on your map. If you defeat the guys here one of them will have enclave hellfire armor as well which is good but there's mark 4 versions as well to be found later. So, so head to the new map marker a field camp not too far from the listening post bravo and defeat the enemies here. It's super easy to kill them if you have the tesla cannon unlocked already. This soldier here has the Enclave Hellfire Power Armor Mark IV for me, so that's worth taking if it's the same for you. And when you're here, you can head to the terminal and read everything on it, and it will want you to track down the Enclave Homan Beacon. You can head from here to close to Vault 95 next to the Glowing Sea, and just a little bit north of it, you will find the Distress Call. Activate it and now you must travel across the glowing sea to reach the Atlantic offices. Once here, head inside and clear all the soldiers. Again, if you have the Tesla cannon, it shouldn't be any problem. And at the very end, you will come across the Colonel, and you can kill him and loot his body for the Enclave Colonel uniform. Don't forget to pick this up though, because once you go away and come back, all of the bodies will disappear from this area. So I think it might be missable. I'm not sure if you can find it elsewhere. But if this is the only place you can find this, then make sure to pick it up while you're here. After this, use the terminal to end lockdown and head outside and kill the remaining soldiers. And for me, this included a legendary Enclave soldier who, once defeated, had the Enclave Exo 2 power armor. So you can pick that up as well. And guys, that is pretty much all there is to this quest. Not a super long one, but adds a bunch of cool stuff to the game, especially very powerful armor and weapons for you to collect. If you want to see more Fallout 4 guides, like and subscribe for more videos, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.